How do I look? Fabulous. My hair's still sweaty. Hi, my name is Trey Kennard from Elk City, Oklahoma, age 17. Ride for Torco Racing Fuels Honda, Planet Fitness Gyms, Amsoil, and No Fear Energy. You make me feel kind of weird. Hey, don't don't film me starting my bike because I won't be able to. Hey dog, we need you to get out of the screen. From Loretta's to the Outdoor Nationals was uh, quite a transition. It uh, it was tough. Just just it's a whole new pace, and there's I mean. I mean, me and Stroop and Izzy and, and all the, the amateur guys were going pretty fast, but there wasn't 40 of us, and we weren't pinned for 30 minutes. So uh, it's it's a whole different game, and, and um, I mean, the outdoors is gnarly, and I'm really looking forward to uh, the outdoor season, but I'm trying to get through the Supercross season and concentrate on that right now. Uh, Supercross season so far has been really good. The first two rounds went really good for me. Uh, just just been trying to get good starts and do the best that I can and hadn't really had, had uh, goals of winning or, or that kind of thing and just been out there trying to do the best that I can and, and so far I think it's working you know I'm just trying to put my head down and not worry about anybody else but myself and and uh, just go give it everything I got every time. Man, when the first Supercross was, man, I still smile thinking about it, man. If, if that thought pops in my head, it's just like, I mean, all the money in the world, everything in the world just couldn't compare to that. It was probably the greatest thing I've ever had. And, and uh, you know, I'm so pumped that, that that happened the first one, but I'm uh, just trying to, trying to stay forward and look down and, and uh, do the best that I can at every one of them and, and uh, see how the season turns out. I mean, I'm a rookie, and, and rookie make mistakes, but I mean, I'm technically not a rookie. I've been racing since I was three years old, so I mean, yeah, everyone makes mistakes. No one's perfect. Uh, I made about 10 or 12 of them last weekend. You know, I went down once and made about 10 mistakes when, when they were guys, those guys were behind me, but yeah, mistakes happen, you know. It's just part of racing, and it's always going to happen, but... The only thing you can do is be as prepared as possible and, and uh, be as mentally and physically strong as possible and put in your time. And I think I've been doing that and, and uh, yeah, I know every race isn't going to go perfect and things aren't going to be peachy keen, but I'm just going to do the best that I can and, and be as prepared as possible and, and uh, we'll see how it goes. Little photo being down that far, I mean, I... I hadn't really thought about it, you know. I mean, obviously it's crossed in my head a couple of times, but like I said, I'm just trying to keep my head clear of that and, and focus on the races and, and task at hand. No, dog. Oh, no, 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 hey, go, 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 can you do some anchor man for old time's sake, I mean, you can never get enough anchor man, Lennon, Lennon, like sheep's wolf, yeah, Greg, he's been having me work my arms, you know, doing like a thousand arm curls, it's like, you got your, uvulus muscle which links to your upper dorsimus. It's boring but it's my life. You got something to say to me? Why don't you talk to me in the mic? Got a bike at mic right here. Testing, testing, one, two. Yeah, what's up? <laughs> Is that kind of arrogant? Like if people don't haven't seen Joe Dirt they'd be like, whoa, what's up with this kid? Well, I'll just put this part in too. What? You're gonna put this part in? Yeah. So does it make me look like such an idiot? 
that's that's good. I like I like what you're what you're doing there. That's a wrap. See you at Daytona.